All right, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. And uh, I know it's kind of late because I already finished the um, uh, Garden of Sinners event, but I decided to roll. I'm I'm gonna try to roll for actually for Fujino because she is the rarest servant in the game. I think, if I'm not mistaken. But um, Saber Shiki is also good. I, I kind of need a really good uh, Saber. But anyway, um, I'm not gonna try to roll like for all of my sand quartz, right? I'm not. I'm not. I'm not doing that. I'm just gonna roll for uh, tickets. I'm, I'm trying to roll for tickets only. See how is my luck is going to be. Uh, let's, 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 let's see. Um, so I have a friend who say that do not skip the animation and that is exactly what I am going to do keep watching every animation yeah so anyway um I just finished the event like 3 days ago and I was deciding whether or not to actually roll for Fujino but then like my friend he was like roll for her and yeah so that's what I'm doing right now but if I remember I already made like three banners uh, in the past and so far two out of three banners is actually I got something but the thing is that I wasted too many Saint Quartz so yeah uh, it was a really bad decision not for the Sherlock banner though I like I I personally like Sherlock, that's why I'm trying to get him to an NP5. But I wasted Abigail because I thought that I could get her to NP2 at least. But then like I actually ended up wasting out of my Saint Quartz. Well it was like I think it was like 400 ish Saint Quartz. So yeah. But this time if I got Fujino, just one, I'm, I'm probably gonna stop rolling. But so far, I don't have much luck. I don't know, a lot of... Uh, a few of my friends say that if you have a bad luck strike, then you should stop. Like not try to roll any further. I, I should have taken that advice. But the thing is that since I'm recording the video, I cannot just like stop and then go back and record it again. I'm, I'm kind of lazy. Wow, I got Archer and Saber, but none of them are gold. Great. Man, I, I would laugh if they turn into gold. I mean, if they turn into gold and it's Fujino, I'm gonna laugh. But my my rank my my luck ranking is so freaking low that I don't think that I can get either of them. Even though Fujino is a four star, she got a higher uh, um, she has a higher rate. But I don't I don't know she, she Shiki is 
a five star, so she have a lower rate, but you know, a rider. So my friend, right? Um, he has both Fujino and Shiki, but he told me that he got a higher chance of getting a five stars than getting a four stars, and I was like, really? Are you actually that lucky? And he actually that lucky, so he got Shiki before she, uh, uh, he he got Shiki before he got um, Fujino, which is like, how is that even possible? Oh, uh, Lancer, never mind. I think this is kind of bad too because there are uh, Jekyll and Hyde, uh, Boudica and also Mephisto so they are like 3 stars and below 3 stars I think and and yeah 3 star got a higher spawn rate than uh, 4 star and 5 star so I may have more um, I'm gonna try the friend point someone just for, you know, that ritual, friend point ritual. I doubt that I'm gonna get um, both of them or either of them, but I'll, I'll try my best. Wow, so far craft essences. Yeah, so I'm I'm trying to save up so I can um summon Scotty. So so the good thing about this year spoiler alert, right? Uh the good thing about this year banner is that um, Sherlock will come back with two more banners and one of the banners is also for Scotty. So if I if I summon that, uh, that banner, I could get two birds in one stone if I'm lucky, right? I can get like either of both Scotty or Sherlock. Um, Edmund Dante is also coming back. I'm, I'll try to summon him if I have enough um, Saint Quartz. But the, but the difficulties of this year is that those banners are kind of close together. So Sherlock and Scotty is like around July-ish. And um, Edmund Dante is like in August. So they're kind of close together. I I I may decide to roll for um, murder at Kogetsugan, uh, which is coming up like around March or April, I think. Um, it's it's a Sherlock banner, of course. So, but I may not do so because my luck is you guys you guys know from my previous videos that my luck is not that good. So rolling for Sherlock without saving up for Scotty is it's not a good it's not a good idea. So far this is not good. Not good at all. So, so far, 
I think I got all of the um, gift servants um, except for Iris View because I found out that I'm so lazy to play that uh, event. So I didn't play um, the event where you got Iris View for free. I think I'm probably stop around 10 if I don't get any 4 star and probably come back tomorrow. So far it's been like 3 stars. So And I'll I'll, I'll kind of decide whether or not I will use sand quartz for this banner. Probably like around 90 sand quartz. But yeah. Yeah, Bodica. I think I got her like 3 times, 2 times. Man, funny how I got like a bunch of servants and none of them is actually a 4 stars or above. I don't know, like in Abigail's banner, I have a lot of servant streak. But none of them is Abigail until like the very very end. Which is kinda bad. Rider again, Bodica. Nope, Ushiwakamaru. Oh yeah, um, if you guys watch uh, Fate Babylonia, uh, please comment below. I've been watching it. Um, it's really good, even though I already know the story. But the fight scene, man, I I cannot believe that. Even though I know the story, I know where they go and I know how they end. They still surprise me. Like the fight scenes, the characters, the artwork. It's really, really good. Yeah. And, um. Oh! Oh, adventure! Oh, Hessen Lobo. Eh, it's alright. He's alright. He got nothing to say, <laughs> just howling. But yeah, um, so coming up is, um, I believe is Camelot movie. I, I believe it's a movie. I hope it's not because Camelot is like, it's also another really good story. Um, and then Heaven's View is coming up around March, the end of March. Um, yeah, the third, the third and the last part of Heaven's View. And uh, I cannot wait for, you know, for more movies or more TV show about Fate, especially Fate Grand Order. This year's gonna be fun. So Lost Bells coming out, new event coming out. God is coming out, Sherlock Holmes and Edmund Dantes returning. A lot of good servants are coming back and a lot of new servants are also um, going to release in the, um, the North American server. Oh man. Is this is this David raid up or something? You know what? I'm I'm just gonna keep going for I 
I don't think I'm I have a chance anymore because I already have Hessian Lobo for some reason. I thought Hessian Lobo was um, a story lock servant, so I don't know why is he appear here. Is he having a raid up in this banner or something? I don't know. Oh man, not a Lancer. Man, I even though it's Fujino who is a four stars raid up, I cannot get her. What is wrong with my luck? Like I I know there are a lot of people who also went through the same thing as I am. Like you know having a bad luck in rolling, but. Compared to a, like to my friend who is like really lucky, he rolled five stars. He rolled five stars like for servants that he wanted. Like he won Abigail, he got Abigail, he got Kokusai, and he got Ereshkigal. Those three are like usually if you got those three, you have like a an, an A rank luck but man I can only get Abigail and he only did uh, he, he got all three of them in around like 500 sand quartz but man 500 sand quartz it took me like almost 2000 same course just to get to Sherlock and I don't I right now I'm still kind of regretting why did I make that decision even though Sherlock is like my favorite character but yeah um, NP2 Sherlock and uh, yeah and then Abigail NP1 Abigail NP3 Enkidu for some reason the last ticket. I doubt that I'm gonna get her. But yeah, but like... Caster, really? I knew it. So yeah. Well... Should I roll... 90 Saint Quartz? Probably 90, see how it goes. Wish me luck guys. I'm risking, I'm taking risks for a higher chance of getting Fujino and a lower chance of getting Scotty or Sherlock. I'm not gonna I'm not going to skip the animation. They guaranteed at least a 4 stars and above, but usually what I got is always a 4 stars um, crap essence. I still don't know how the heck I got Hessian Lobo. Because Hessian Lobo was, um, was a story box uh, servant, so... Yeah, so how come he's appearing in this banner? So far it's been uh, 3 stars, I think. So yeah, so I'm so right. Oh man, no. This is a 4 stars. But yeah, so I'm not skipping the animation anymore because that's what uh, my friend told me to do. And now I'm going to prove him wrong 
that skipping animation won't help me. Wow, I got two hectares at the same time. Oh wow, another four stars. I don't think I, I'm, I'm yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get uh, Fujino in this one. I dab it. Another caster, Mephisto. Yep. I got three Mephistos and two Hectors. Wow. And the four stars, like I say, if it's come to four stars, I always get Craft Essence. Unless, like, I'm really, really lucky. Nope, Mephisto again. Nope, Jiro Remo. What? Oh wow. Nah, never mind then. I don't think I'm gonna get this one either. It's a 4 stars already. Another 4 star craft essence. Oh no. What is wrong with me with crap essence, people? Oh, is it? Is it? <gasps> yes! Oh, oh, I got her. Oh my god, that spark. Okay, okay, I think he might be right. I think my friend might be right. And I... Okay, so I, I don't know if you guys noticed that, but... I noticed that that was uh, Fujino the moment I saw the cart turning around. If you guys noticed that... Um, I don't know, it's, this is just a theory, right? I saw that when the cart turned around. Um, oh wait, I got a new crap essence. I'm sorry, I digress. Um, when the cart turned around, you know that the cart have two faces: the the back, the back face, and the front face. The front face is like a servant, like uh, archer, uh, you know. So, the moment that I know it was. Uh, about to change the card was because there was no backside, meaning that both sides are the same card. Um, so you know, like the backside is blank and the front side is the servant. Oh my god, look at how many 4 stars do I got, oh god. So, yeah, so, so again, so when the card, this is just a theory, right? Um, The card, the back side was blank and then the front side showed you what class that card is. But the moment I see that the back side became the class card, meaning there's no blank side to the card, I know that card is going to turn. I, I, I don't know, it's just a theory. You guys can come back and confirm it for me. But I believe that it was about to change. But now I got food, you know. I'm probably going to stop. But before that, I'm gonna take a picture. Hold on. <laughs> There you go. I'm gonna take a picture and send it to my friend. And yeah, so I got Fujino. Um. 
Yeah, I'm gonna lock her. I cannot believe that. He, I think my friend might be right about not skipping the animation. Because I always skip the animation because I hoard a lot of sand cords throughout my gameplay. So, not skipping the animation would make my um, video to be like 3 hours long. But, should I try? Should I try for Shiki though? Because I don't want to waste another 30. Hmm. You know what? I'm probably gonna come back tomorrow for Shiki because to um tomorrow um there is a gift for me which is like ten summoning tickets. So I'm I'm going to use that for Shiki again. Um I, I doubt that I'm gonna get uh, her because you know my luck is not that good. But yeah, thank you again for watching my video. Please subscribe to my channel and Comments below for your favorite servant so I can have like a general idea on who should I summon for in the future. And uh, thank you you guys for watching and peace.